Hello and welcome back to Ultima 4. We are right where we left off last time. We are here by the town of Paws. And uh, we're, we were, I was talking about making my way up to Lord British's castle. And I still want to do that because if nothing else, I want to get my level up. I also kind of want to visit Hawkwind and see how I'm doing on things. See if what I'm, you know, letting people that want to escape, escape. Let's see if it's helping with our problematic things and all that. But first, we're here at Paws, the town of horses. We need horses. We've actually got half the gold that we need for horses. Because uh, it was 400 gold pieces for horses, I believe. And so I think that's worthwhile while we're here. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to kind of explore the countryside here around Paws. And see what there is to see. Maybe we'll find something else. And I'm sure we'll find plenty of orcs and rogues and, you know, whatever else. And we can kill them and get some gold. Hopefully have enough to not only buy horses, but stock up on some reagents. I thought about doing this off camera since it is kind of a grindy uh, process. But at the same time, I didn't want to come across a dungeon or something like that uh, and, and not have that be on camera. So that's why I thought we would do this together. So uh, let's see. Oh, and here we go. Right off, we start earning our money. Okay, so we need to, I, I don't, I wish I could change um, kind of the default placement of our party because our melee people are at the back, which is kind of annoying. But I want to get them up front um, so that, because they've got the melee weapons and they've, I, I've got to get them better armor. Um, Let's see. You are going to wait. I'm going to attack. Heavily wounded. You got to wait. You got to wait. Attack. Missed. Lightly wounded. Okay, Julia, now. Now is your time to shine. Cool. So she killed her rogue. And now we've got uh, the one in front of Shamino and Iolo. And that guy's killed. Excellent. Um, we will have Iolo open up. 79 gold. Excellent. We are on our way. I, I normally... Oh, Annette. Uh, headless. Headless. Wow. There'd be a oh, and what in the blazes is that up there? Okay, I think there's going to be a little a little spelling spelling going on here pretty quick, because uh, there are a lot of these guys, and as I recall, I was going to say as I recall they're pretty they're pretty um, difficult, but at the same time, uh, here we are, and we've already got one heavily wounded, and now that one's dead. I am a little concerned about the shield and, and sword guy. I'm not quite sure what that's supposed to be. I guess we'll find out when we kill it. Okay, that one's heavily wounded. Iolo doesn't have a target. Right now, the only person that's got a target is me, and I missed. All right, well, that was worthless. All right, attack, attack. Wait, wait, attack. Attack. Wait, wait. Okay, so this is interesting. Uh, all right. Attack. Attack. Ooh, good job. Uh, Julia. And he misses. All right. Uh, I don't know what the sword th shield thing is, and I'm a little nervous that it's... um. It's a phantom. All right, we've already lightly wounded it. So I'm thinking it can't be too tough. Uh, let's see, let's, okay, we got that guy. Get rid of that guy, that guy, that's kind of important. I'm gonna send these, let our melee dudes, okay, deal with that phantom. He's fleeing, okay, so we're gonna let the phantom flee. That headless is fleeing. 
You know, Phantom, if you're going to flee, I would appreciate it if you would actually flee. Sham and all, I'm going to move out of the way. All right, let's, let's, we were kind of hemming him in. Maybe we need to give him room. All right, so we've got more headless to deal with. Okay, that one's killed. So I'm not certain at this point, are they all fleeing? No, we got one here that's still coming at us, I think. Yep. He's lightly wounded. Get us in position so we can all four of us take this guy out. All right, so we just got to wait for this phantom to get off the field of battle here. Excellent. Get. Um, uh, we'll have Iolo do that again. 47 gold. We're doing pretty good. We, ha I mean, I can see pause. Well, not literally on the screen, but I mean, it's not that far away. I haven't even tried the bridges yet. I don't know if we're going to get orcs on the, on the bridges. And we're already at 325 gold. So this is uh, not bad. Okay, so we made it across that one without incident. Oh, wow. Made it across both of them. I'm surprised. Oh, here's some orcs. Lots of orcs. You notice the numbers rack up the more people we have. Okay, so I'm going to attack you. And I'm going to attack you. All right. And Julia's going to come up. And Shamino's going to come up. Oh, I hate that guy. I hate that guy. Heavily wounded. Heavily wounded. All right. Attack. I missed. What happened to Iolo's guy? This, I didn't think he was fleeing. But yet he's not lined up. Maybe he's, he's trying to be sneaky and circumspect here and, and, and flank us. Um, all right. I'm going to move Iolo over. You got to wait. I'll move you over. I'm going to move you over. I think we're going to do three on one here to get rid of this. Um, to get rid of this guy. Troll. So the, the ones without the helmets are, I guess those maybe not helmets. I always think of them as helmets, but maybe they're like horns. All right. So the troll is fleeing. All right. Shamino doesn't have a target. Come on. If you're fleeing, dude, then flee. All right, you're killing me here. I think he's. I think he's too hemmed in. I don't think. I think it's because. Oh, we got two trolls. Oh dear, that's not good. I didn't even notice that. So we've killed one. I don't want to. I don't want to attack that one. He's supposed to be fleeing. Oh, that was me. Sorry. I was busy looking at Shamino. Okay, so that guy does appear to be fleeing now. That's good news. Okay, so we got an orc that's escaped. Now that orc is fleeing. Okay. So now we need to take on this guy. He's barely wounded. I'm going to send Julia up there. Because I don't think... I think once somebody's next to him, he's going to... He's going to stay put. Okay, heavily wounded. Now he's fleeing. So let's give him room to flee. Um, I'm a little concerned about... Ugh, come on, dude. You're fleeing. Flee. I thought this troll was fleeing. I'm a little confused what this what this orc is here. Okay, apparently it's chasing, seems to be chasing Shamino. I, I just hate it so much that they continue to take pot shots. Okay, this guy is definitely chasing Shamino. All right, so we're just gonna get him down here so that we can help him. with this 
orc. Although he could probably take him on by himself, but we'll just do this so then I can attack. We can get at least two attacks on him. He's heavily wounded. I'll move Iolo just in case. I can have time to get him in position. And we don't. All right, good. Um, all right, so we will have Iolo open the chest. He's getting very good at this. Uh, I think I'm going to hold up in camp here. Because Julie and Shamino, they're still only level two. And um, they don't have a lot of health. So I, I don't want them to get down too far. All right, good. So we're all back to full health here. Very good. All right, so what else is there to attack around here? Oh, we got a bunch of stuff to attack. Excellent, excellent. That guy's fleeing already. What a pansy. <laughs> uh, let's see. I don't want to do that because I'll hit the guy that is fleeing. All right. Uh, let's come over one here. Uh, that was stupid, but yeah, she's just doing a practice swing there. That was a practice swing. It's just, you know, like, you know, in baseball, and you're standing on deck. Okay, we got a couple of these guys heavily wounded. Uh, let's see, that was Julia. So now that rogue is fleeing. All right, so we can attack this guy here. I keep missing. Okay, that rogue is fleeing. It does get kind of tough to keep track of of who is fleeing. I th especially when they come in the you know, the guy next to Iolo there. I mean, he was fleeing, but he's got to flee next to Iolo. And I'm I'm doing my level best to try to not to get these guys that are the practice swing for Julia not to attack these guys that are fleeing, but when they stay close, it's hard to tell. Barely wounded. All right. I keep missing. It's annoying. We all miss there. Wow, that's horrible. That's just horrible. Okay, he's heavily wounded. Barely wounded. Can you finish him off? Yes, Julia finished him off. That's good. All right, so everybody that we have left is somebody that um, we can kill. That guy's lightly wounded. All right. Get everybody in position here. We can wail on these last couple guys. So that guy's fleeing. It seems like both of these guys are fleeing. I missed that one of them was fleeing, I think. But let's just see. Okay, yeah, they're fleeing. We'll just pass here and let them go. Be gone with ye. Uh, Iolo does, like usual. 29 gold. What happened to my gold? What happened to our gold? What in the hell happened to our gold? We had almost 400 gold. And now we've got 269 gold. I'm, I'm so confused by that. I missed something. Did one of those rogues, they must have stolen some gold from us. Those rat bastards. I'm, I'm not happy. I'm not happy about that at all. How dare they steal from the horses for everyone fun? That's just that's just not that's just not how how this is done here, guys. That's that's just not kosher. All right. All right. We're almost in position, I think. <laughs> that guy's fleeing already. We'll 
let's wait for one of these guys to come over here where we can get to him. And we missed. All right, so we're just waiting on this guy to flee. All right, get. Who opens Shamino or Iolo does? 31 gold. And now it's 329. Maybe the game's hiccuping because I don't. I wasn't at two hundred and ninety something, was I? I don't know. I'm confused. I'm confused. What happened there? I've got no sense of what happened there at all. All right, let's let's kind of uh, explore out this way. Head west a bit. Let's see what there is to see. Another bridge. Yeah, I don't think... I'm not sure what this bridge is. Okay. Where's this ominous little path taking us? I don't know that it's ominous, necessarily. There's Scarabray. That's Scarabray. So we found we found the, um, the coastline here where Scarabray's at. Um, okay. Got a headless here. It's just one of them. Yeah, that was quick. 90 gold. And now we're at 419. All right. <laughs> I don't even want to know. I don't even know what happened to our gold there. We'll make our ways back toward Paws. And, you know, there's, if there's other things that want to attack us, we'll do that. And then maybe we'll have some extra gold to buy some reagents. That would be nice. I, I really am unable to believe our luck today at um, the bridges. Of course, now I'm going to cross two. Ah, there we go. All right, this is more I'm looking for or expecting. Three trolls. Ouch. Okay, so. But we've been dealing with trolls. They're not that scary. They just tend to be tougher. I got to get my... Yeah, my melee guys being in the back is just annoying. Gotta get them up front here. I'm actually gonna take a step back. All right, our melee guys can wait. I don't know what you're shooting at, dude. There's nobody over there. <laughs> okay, so that troll's fleeing. Ugh. I'm gonna have to move down here because I gotta protect Julia a bit from the ranged attacks. Because obviously that guy is just going to hang back. So now he's fleeing. Okay, that guy that's fleeing seems to be petrified with terror because he's just standing right there. Okay, now there he goes. Oh, so is that guy fleeing? Gosh darn it. I think he was starting to flee and I missed it. The guy that's in the center, I think they're all fleeing now. Let's just see what's going to happen. If you're gonna flee, flee! Yeah, they're fleeing. Shooting as they do so, which annoys the snot out of me. Yeah, we're gonna need to hold up and sleep again, I think. Oops, get. Iolo, the only one that's got full health. All right, now these are odds I like. He's already fleeing. Be gone with you. Don't flee toward us, moron. <laughs> he had to just take a wide turn there. All right. Get Iolo. 62 gold. Now we're, we're doing good on gold. I, I have enough for, for horses and reagents. Uh, let's hold up and camp. Let's get everybody back to full health in case we got more trolls when we cross the other bridge. I really shouldn't have said anything. You know, I, I, I said... You know, oh, things are looking good. Ooh, what are those? Those are bugs. We're not supposed to attack them because they're non-evil creatures. So what do we do here? And a cat. I think we just need to leave the field of battle. 
uh, if we can. It's not easy to do because they're blocking our way. All right. And then about the people that are sleeping, I'm not quite sure what's going to happen there. What if I what if I cast spell cast spell sleep? That didn't seem to work on bugs. Actually, it's the, it has worked on some of them. Okay, so he's gone. But I don't know what to do about my sleeping companions. Because they're just getting bit by the bugs. Oh, this is Shamino. So that was Iolo and Shamino. It's me and Julia that are still asleep. So Shamino can cast. Well, I guess everybody can cast depending upon the level of the magic. He probably couldn't do something bigger. <sighs> I mean, you think... Okay, there we go. Now we're waking up. Now we're waking up. All right, I need to make a hole. I'm going to get... I'm going to get Shamino out of here. See, because I'm thinking we shouldn't even be attacking these guys. Okay, those insects are fleeing. I'm going to follow them. Because, because the thing says... Oh, I should have followed the insects that were fleeing. Because the thing says, do not attack non-evil creatures. And so, I'm guessing... A strict interpretation of that does not mean and I killed some there but I don't think there's a, a much of a way around that doesn't mean attack them all right we're gonna have to hold up and camp again doesn't mean attack them but let them flee but don't attack them so I think where possible we should not attack the non-evil creatures okay so we're back to full health again but that's tough in that space. Now these guys are evil creatures, so we can um, we can attack them to our heart's content. I'm gonna move back, and then we're gonna start going all tacky tacky. Move Julie up, move Shamino up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can do range. We can do range attacks too. And if you really tick me off, you get a fireball in your face. All right. That guy's heavily wounded. That's a good start. Iolo, you really need to to do to do some things to pull your weight. Heavily wounded still. All right, Julia, lightly wounded. Come on, Shamino, lightly wounded. All right, I'm gonna have to move down here and help Julia. Heavily wounded. That troll's fleeing. Great. Which means he probably isn't. Okay, there we go. Beautiful. Thank you for getting out of the way so I can uh, attack the Etten. Now, is that troll fleeing? I don't think so. Yeah, he's barely wounded. So we're going to wait for this Etten to get up here where I can attack him. And then maybe we'll pull Iolo forward. I think the troll up top is fleeing. It is really tough to remember who's fleeing and who is not. Now the Etna is fleeing. All right, let's see. They're not moving forward. So the Etna is leaving. Okay, so I'm gonna we're gonna we're gonna double team. I'm not sure if that troll in front of me is fleeing. Ugh. I know this troll that's over here in front of Shamino and Iolo's not. Okay, I guess you're not fleeing. Because you're throwing rocks and you're getting in our faces. Okay, so we killed that one. I think this guy's supposed to be fleeing now. 
I think, but the one that's here next to Iolo. Okay, so they're now all supposed to be fleeing. Let's give them some room to flee. So flee. Don't throw stuff at me, flee. Come on, flee if you're gonna flee. Maybe if we get off the bridge. Make some room. I don't want to. I don't want to leave the field of battle. But I'm thinking we just give them some space. Come on, dude. If you're gonna flee, flee. I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna move up. Are you not going to flee? Seriously, should I go and take this fool out? I thought they were both fleeing. Maybe he changed his mind. Sometimes they get their their second wind here and they... Uh... All right, well, whatever whatever he's done now. I don't know. All right, let's see if we can get the pause. I mean, I, we really need to hold up and camp again, but... We're at 620 gold, so we're in really good shape, gold-wise. Market. We actually, we actually need to buy before reagents. We need to buy some. Um, how do I get in there? We need to buy some food because we're down to 34. Now there's four of us. We go through it a lot faster. Yes, you can interest me in horses. Only 400 gold pieces. Yes, I'll buy. Here, a better breed thou shalt never find. Oh, look at us. We look like a horse. A horses. I didn't realize we could actually do horses in town. Yes, you may interest. So we have 220. 25 for 30, which is a little pricier than other places. <sighs> so if I bought three, that'd be 75, I guess, to 100. Let's, yeah, I'll do. And that leaves us with 130, 130 there. Okay, anything else? No. Goodbye, come again. Okay, and let's go see if we can find the reagent shop. It was behind a hidden door. All right, so let's take a look at our stats. 975 for me, wow. I'm at least level five. I don't remember. So level five is 800. I think it's kind of exponential. So I think level six is in until like 1600. So I still have a ways to go. Iolo is getting closer to level five, but he's not there yet. Um, Julia is, is still short of level three. She's got to get to 200, I'm pretty sure. Uh, Shamino's almost at 200. Excellent. That's good news. Okay, so we're doing good on all that. I haven't been using my dagger, so none of that's changed. We did get the, the Rune of Honor. All right, so let's look at what we have. We have 15 Fireball, 10 Healing, 9 Cure Spells. And we used up one Sleep Spell that was of limit. Well, it did. It did put some of them to sleep. Okay, so if I wanted to make more Cure Spells, Garlic Ginseng. Fireball is Sulfur, Ash, and Black Pearl. All right, so if I go back here. So Garlic and Ginseng. So right now we can make four more Cure Spells if we needed to. So that would be enough to do an emergency heal on everybody once. Or emergency cure. All right. Fireball, we need Sulfur, Ash, and Black Pearl. So we get a ton of Black of Sulfur, Ash. We're good with that. Uh, we probably need some more black pearls so we can make more fireballs at need. Okay, I like that. Uh, ginseng and spider silk. So maybe buy some more ginseng and spider spider silk and some more uh, black pearl. I think that's probably what we want to do here. All right. So if I can talk to you from horseback, because that's how you do things now that you have horse. 
Yes, I'm in need of reagents. Okay, so we're good with sulfur sash. Uh, I said I was going to buy some more ginseng. Four gold pieces. How many would I like? Let's buy six. Let's see. No, I ain't going to have. I need ginseng for cure. I need ginseng for heal. Cure heal. Let's buy. So 15 times four would be 60. That's a lot. If I bought six times four, that would be math. <laughs> That'd be 24. Let's buy 10. That'd be 40. Okay. Oh, maybe I can get a bit of a deal. Can I do like 38? All right, good. So now we've got 14 ginseng. Garlic. Um, I'd like to get a few more garlics. Uh, garlic is two gold pieces. I have seven. I'm looking at my gold here. Let's do 10. That'll be 20. Maybe I can get it for 18. Excellent. Make a little bit of a deal there. And then for Fireball, I said I needed Black Pearl. And Black Pearl is seven gold pieces. I have zero. I have 74 gold. All right. Well, then I guess I will get 10. And that'll give me 10 of those. Uh, let's see. Can we do like... Can we do 60? Oh, I could. All right, good. All right, I think that's good. Those are for the main... I, I thought about doing another blink spell, but we have horses now. We shouldn't need a blink spell. I don't think. Anything else? No, I think we're good. All right. All right, let's go out into the world again. I thought we were supposed to be able to outrun things. What's the, what's the point of horses? Because we don't seem to be any faster. I guess I'm, I'm not understanding. <laughs> There's some key thing here I'm not getting. Uh, because, uh, yeah, they don't... Um, they aren't doing much for me at this point. For 400 gold pieces, I expected some sort of competitive advantage. And I'm not really feeling... Oh, that was fleeing. Oh, good, I missed. All right, uh, let's get you down. You can wait, you can wait, you can, I can wait. Move him over. Wait, 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 attack! Lightly wounded. Okay, that skeleton's fleeing now, so we gotta wait for him to get done fleeing. Don't wait, don't flee toward me. That skeleton's fleeing. So I think the only one that's not fleeing is the one that's coming from the north there. I should have had Iolo attack. All right, you flee, skellies. I, at least they don't have a range attack. He's barely wounded. We'll see what happens when he gets... I should have got Shamino up there because then he could... He could we could maybe give him... some um, experience. We got to get him closer to uh, to level three. All right, good. So that guy's dead. It would be nice if, um, I guess I'll open it. 31 gold. All right. Yeah, I don't know what's going on here. I don't seem to be outrunning anything. I guess I am. I had to outrun that guy. For all the good it did me. All right. You can outrun them in pasture. If you get into like something that's going to slow you down, you can't. All right. So that's that's pretty good. So we don't, you know, we can choose then if we feel like battling these guys or, or not. Now, the problem is they're both right there outside the town. When I leave the town, uh, leave, leave, leave the village, they're going to be waiting for me. But I think we'll go ahead and stop it there. It was, uh, it was a good day. We got horses now. And uh, we can ride like the wind across the countryside. And that's what we need to do. We need to start exploring this whole countryside. And so I think horses will be a good investment so that we don't necessarily have to fight 
every stinking little band of orcs we can we can just outrun them if we want to gives us a lot more uh choices as far as what it is we're doing but i think uh, i'm gonna let that be that for this episode so i will be back again next time with more ultima for fun we'll probably head north over land over our pony here and get back to lord british's castle and see how things are shaken there so i do hope you join me then and until next time be seeing you.